What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome to episode one of the PC Poor Man's RTG. Um, much like last year, we started a PC Road to Glory and it went down very, very well. We had our ups and downs, but in general, it was like a 36 or 37 episode stint on the PC before switching back to uh, the PlayStation. This year, we're still going to do some stuff on the PS5, um, the draft stuff and a few other like 6pm content and whatnot. But we're going to do everything, everything else for on the PC for as long as I can go. Um, there's going to be a whole bunch of questions. Obviously, the first question is going to be coming up is why are you starting this now? You know, we've talked about gameplay being dead and buried for me and uh, the enjoyment levels of FIFA not being there. And uh, one, there's a couple of reasons in general. Uh, one of those reasons being um, that I, like after taking a break of FIFA, I kind of get the desire and drive to play it again, right? And so for the last two weeks specifically, we've been playing a whole bunch of Warzone, a bit of PUBG, and loads of F1 and limited FIFA. Like I probably played like other than squad battles games for objectives, like maybe six, eight games of FIFA in a couple of weeks. It's been really, really limited. So there is that desire for that and, and the want to create a brand new account. Like always, for me personally, this is always the funnest part of FIFA, starting the brand new account again. Um, but one of the other big inspirations was actually watching Run the Foot Market Nick on his Rap to Glory, uh, PC Road to Glory. It kind of reminded me of my enjoyment levels last year i went back and watched a couple of the videos from last year and was just like yeah i want to do it you know like listen i just it might be the sort of thing that after a week i'm like this was a huge mistake but for the time being it's exciting i love the start of the uh the series as i said you know we've got a lot of enjoyment of the icon swaps we've got alessandrini there for 24 hours i don't know if i have enough time to get him to be fair but because i'm not going to be uh I don't know how much time I'm going to have tomorrow to get him. The the start of the game, the Atal grinding for him, seeing where we place on PC, seeing how we fare in champs and in rivals, and uh, basically just going from there. But uh, the idea behind it is to just have fun for the rest of the year like we did last time around. Now, if in the first few episodes there are sound issues, video issues, or whatever, just... Oh, look at that. It's got my team name from last year as well. First owner FC. Um, just bear with me whilst we uh, try and figure that out. Um, let's add a high-rated loan player to the squad. We're about to sign a loan to replace Penfold. And we are going to take... We're going to take Alexandro, actually. No, we're going to take Jordi Alba. He could hopefully be the most useful uh, in those early stages. Um, what kits do we want? Oh, the Al Hazem kit is actually quite a nice kit there. We'll take that as our first kit. Maybe Melbourne City is a second kit. Or maybe Norway. A Norway kit is quite nice, isn't it? Back out and pick again. Wait, you can do that? That's crazy. Um, I, I quite like the Norway kit there. So we'll go for the Al Hazem and Norway kit. And then for the badge. Um, and let's get into the game. Go with the Real Madrid badge. Why not? Why not? And uh, that is going to be the start for us. So obviously we have no coins. We have got some things because this was um, this was the ultimate edition. I couldn't not have the ultimate edition because of the version of uh, the EA Play that I have, basically. Um, and uh, you can back out the loan pickers position locked. Oh, I see. Uh, we're going to take Trent here just because I know I'm going to need him again, hopefully for friendlies and whatnot. We've got a couple of nice kits to put in straight away as well. Maybe I should have taken Haaland there. Uh, we've got the loan player and content pack from the pre-order. I, I don't even remember what this is or what it might be. Um, so it's the FIFA 21 home kit, the team of the week home kit. A 90 uh, Kylian Mbappe. Is, I think he's supposed to be there as well, isn't he? And then three gold loan players. Well, we'll take Haaland. Uh, Haaland or Felix? Felix with the five-star skills might help early on in the game. Kylian Mbappe loan there as well is going to be uh, quite nice. A whole bunch of uh, content for us there as well. And it's going to be really interesting to see, A, how quickly... Wait, didn't we just open this? A, how quickly we can um, get to champs. And where we can get to in rivals, and B, just how quickly we can actually put together a, a squad that is competitive, I suppose, in in that regard, you know. Um, so we got—I don't even know what this pick was. 
Oh, is that Gareth Bale? What a start. This is our uh, one to watch card. I know he's not worth much on the market and we can't sell him anyway. But another Premier League player. So Bale and uh, Trent can link together straight away, which is quite nice. Now, this, this, I think last year I did it as a first owner, uh, which is why I think we're called First Owner FC. But I think I might not be a first owner this year. I might just buy players as and when I want them. Just, to, oh, this is tradable. Some of these guys selling. You know what? It doesn't matter if they are selling. I know the French League players are selling. Maybe Zagadou sells. Yeah, we'll take a thousand coins for him. Um, because I want to be able to I want to be able to get enough content to do some eight one plus picks just to see if it's uh, helpful. Should discard and do SBCs. Yeah, see, for me, I want to get into gameplay as quick as possible. So today's video as well is just going to be the first hour or so on the account, and nothing more and nothing less. Um, if you know, from tomorrow onwards, maybe it'll be a it'll be a bit different and I'll cut out a lot of the crap and stuff. But yeah, for the first uh, hour or so, I want to keep it all, um, every, you showing you everything because I'm streaming it right now. And of course, if you guys want to come and watch the live streams where we stream all of the content, fb.gg slash Nepentez, link is down below. But I know I'm going to get a lot of questions from the stream that are going to be asked in the comments. So I'm going to kind of preemptively answer those uh, as well. Um, so uh, we can also go and look at our preview packs. Now, of course, I don't have any coins. Oh, walkout. Go on then. Just a regular walkout, I think. Go on, Mbappe. Striker, Mbappe. First pack. Oh, it's Lacazette. It's in-form Lacazette, though. That's not bad for a few coins, is it? And uh, he is a rare. But, what's he, 20k? Maybe 23,000, uh, 19, 20k? I think we'll... Uh, oh, do I keep him? Arsenal... I'll keep him for now. I'll keep him for now. Main goal for this series, just to have fun, man, quite honestly. Um, <clears throat> let's pre premium goal pack that. Mbappe's... Oh, Mbappe is a special card, isn't he? It's team of the year right now. What's our premium goal pack saying? Nothing uh, Nothing too special. We can't open it, even if it has something good. Uh, we had a player pick in there as well. And then the gold preview pack. We're just going to skip through this because obviously it's uh, not going to be anything too useful either. And then, uh, yeah, main goal for the series, I suppose, is, is literally just to see what we can build and how quick, right? Um, <clears throat> so, the... What is this? This is the 87 plus guaranteed pack, which guarantees one walkout. It's a what-if card, so not really that interested. It's going to be Kante. Oh, no, it's not going to be Kante. It's going to be uh, Foot Birthday Hour. Wow, they've got very similar flares, haven't they? Um, oh, Ruben Diaz in there as well. Now, Hour is worth... Is he worth 55k? And Ruben Diaz is worth about 25k. So this is actually a profitable pack. So I need to get to 70k coins ASAP. I, I don't think I'm going to be able to do it in that amount of time. Um, I don't think we've got enough hours on the clock before that expires. But we'll have plenty of opportunities to get plenty of good players, I'm sure. So, um, I suppose... Ah, Oh, we get uh, Diego Maradona. We've got a lot of things coming here as well, haven't we? So we get the, the Diego Maradona. We get the XP to start off with early, which is quite nice. The pick your squad uh, thingy with Bobby there. The weekend league reward, which obviously doesn't matter to us until next weekend, where we should be in weekend league. Uh, we don't need to worry about this just now. Um, and that does lead us one objective in. We've got to pick the team objectives. And we're going to pick... Again, I don't think we have too much time on this one either. Oh, six days on this one, actually. So this one's not too bad. So we'll take uh, Rafael Liao. Back out and go back in. Yeah, I might be able to get the coins with rivals. But I just don't have a team to go into rivals with. So, you know what I mean? It's, it's one of those ones where it's, it will just be impossible. Now, is that a loan? Oh, no, that's not a loan. All right, so we've got the Maradona Tifo. Oh, did it? we're not actually getting Maradona. We will go back out and go back into uh, this, though. We've got the transfer market first segment done. 150 coins. I suppose uh, it all adds up. Let us go out and go back in and see what happens. You won't get... F yeah, exactly. Well, we might be able to get five placements done in an hour and 20 minutes with the rage quits, possibly. But what we won't be able to do... 
Um, will this be posted on YouTube? Yeah, this will be going on to the second channel. What we won't be able to do is... Oh, do we get a, a token for free? Um, oh, we get the fan vote as well. Yeah, what we won't be able to do is put together a team good enough um, to, to get anywhere, basically. What do we complete with those objectives there? So season progress one through four. It gives us a, another coin... Uh, coin reward for gameplay and a few packs in there as well and then i suppose what is the first thing to do is it going to be squad battle stuff which is a little bit uh a little bit dead isn't it let's take the supernova that can we just put it as our badge from here oh it's a tifo never mind um we are going to work on atal and winning ways they're going to be super helpful for us in the early stages We've got the FGS kits pack. What are you doing? Collecting draft coins from burner accounts? No, no, we're starting a new... It's, the title uh, kind of uh, explains it. Um, but we're starting a new PC road to glory. Don't you get a draft token? I thought I should get a draft token, actually, yeah. Which would have been real nice because we would have been able to make some coins off of the draft for sure. SBC with those players you just got. Build some coins. We get an 83 trap there as well. A premium gold pack. Um, yeah, what SBC do we do first though? Do, do we go, go and do Prime Gaming? I've already got Prime Gaming connected to a different account, so I can't do it on this one, I'm afraid. Uh, a few contracts that could be uh, quite helpful. A few players. Now, we can do, we probably do an, an upgrade pack. Uh, 181 plus upgrade pack. Have I completed this out? I started the account about 10 minutes ago. Um, so, as you can see in the top left, we've done nothing as yet. Um, yeah, we can we can, we can can go and start doing some of the uh, basic SBC stuff. Yeah, the let's get started and whatnot. And uh, get the packs from these because they give you some players as well. Maybe Moira will be worth it. Maybe. Two red gold players. Uh, so, let's put our bronze player in. Oh, God, it's going to try and teach me everything, isn't it? our first bronze player in there penfold can go in there and uh can go and we'll get him in and we'll get him gone sell anything tradable and do advanced sbcs yeah that's what i was thinking but the tradable stuff that i've got might actually be quite useful for me um in in building a squad for like atal or for whatever sbc that comes today um it might be quite useful for that you know i have about 28 burner accounts all of which i have reset four times each my main account has transferred over 50 million coins no ban jesus lucky you one day it should happen though um so yeah whatever comes like today for example um do the league and nation sbcs are printing money whatever happens today at let's say 6 p.m you know whatever content comes with that we're going to be able to do that that objective, the Alessandrini objective, the Atal objective. We had to get some good stuff through the uh, the SBCs that are there as well. <laughs> do the footies voting day SBC. It's just a gold team. Yeah, but what kind of gold team? As you say, I, as you can see, I have no coins, right? So if I don't have the specific players, I won't be able to do um, any any kind of SBC, right? Atal, the new 6pm will be great additions. It, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Let's do this third step here and get these ones done. These ones are typically quite easy. Three nations, 17 chemistry. Um, so we'll do... Well, I'm going to keep him, I think. What have we got? We've got two Chinese players. We've got an American. And I need a striker. Solanke can go in there. I don't actually know if I'm going to get chemistry on this. No, we need a link, don't we? Have I got another English player? All gold, three rares, 78 low chem. There we go, that's that one done. Watching you play makes me motivated to play champs this week too, because you have a La Liga team. It's the start of the game is and has and will always be, for me, the best part of the game. I don't know why, but it just has been and it will be. All right, so what would be good to hear? So the footies voting day. So this is supposedly quite good. 
Oh, yeah, this is very good. Three rares, 78 rated, 45 chemistry. Doesn't even have to be golds, just 78 rated. Let's go uh, untradables first. So we've only got Tillumans as far as an untradable goes. I might have to put that trap in to get the rating. I've got some tradables, but... We need two rare players. Rafinha and Gulavogui. These are all tradable. We'll get us some coins, I suppose. But this 45k pack might be alright. And then obviously for this weekend league coming. Is he enough there? Yeah, he is enough. He's enough. That's where it cuts off a little bit. There we go. So let's just get ourselves some chemistry on this one. There we go. So that gets us a prime gold players pack. Not too bad. Even starting now, it shouldn't take long to get an Unreal team. Yeah, I, I reckon. Um, I reckon we should be able to get a very good team by next weekend league, which will be our first weekend league. We were, obviously, we won't be able to qualify for this weekend league now. Um, let's hope that we can qualify for next weekend league. It should be there because this weekend as well is going to be a bit of a tricky one to get a lot of time in, in on. Um, but next week, hopefully, I'll be back at home and working from home which will allow me a lot more time to just jump on and, and get involved. As Prime Gold Players Pack is tradable. Of course, if we can get to 70k, that is kind of what we're looking for. Oh, we got bored out of that. Yeah, if we can get up to 70k, it'd be ideal. Two, uh, two nice golds there. Um, yeah, the Icon Swaps 84 by 20 packs will help massively. And aren't they squad battles games? Oh, no, it's online, isn't it? The online for the one token. So we don't get a board or a walkout um, out of that. We get more tradable cards, though. For the time being, I think I'm just going to keep a hold of them as they are. Um, although I can use the... I can use the, um, like, loan players, can't I? Very easy to use the loan players for squad battles. So Mbappe can be used quite comfortably in squad battles. What are my plans for Icon Swaps? So, with regards to Icon Swaps, we're definitely going to do... So, I can't do Tab. I haven't got enough time. I'm going to try and get Alessandrini. I mean, we could do it in squad battles. We probably could do world-class squad battles against the low-rated bronze teams. No problem at all. It's just, it's 10 games. I don't know if I have the time. I don't know. Um, we'll, we'll try our best for that. Um, we've got... Obviously, Silver Beast would be nice to go and get. Weekend League Plus, I'm going to miss out on this weekend. Because I just... Unless I can get qualified today which i can't because again i just don't have the time um so that'll be next week we're definitely going to do uh the weekend league token we'll get the squad battles tokens we'll probably get because we'll work towards a few other things on there as well and then these these three tokens we'll get as well and we'll just take the first things that show up um the 84 by 20 pack the 83 by 20 pack and the 82 whatever you know whatever those packs are uh we'll work on those um pretty quickly in the meantime, we've got to go back into uh, SBCs and carry on. I think the foundations are probably the best best to go into other than... Oh, it's all in foundation now, isn't it? So hybrid nations. Is this easy to do? Is this nice and cheap to do? Can't get weekend league. It runs out next Friday. What do you mean? Don't have the time. This is your job. Doesn't make sense. Yep. There's somebody who has absolutely no idea about anything. Um, all right. So the first one, the final four. 70 rated, 80 chemistry. Let's see, I don't know if I, I think I'd rather go straight in and start working on. Um, I think we're going to go and start working on. The squad battles straight away. So we've got an easy team here to play on world class, which is fine. We're going to delete this squad. And uh, create new squad. First owner. 
and we're going to put together just whatever gold players we've got. So Mbappe, Mbappe and Laka get some uh, chemistry together as well, which is nice. Gareth Bale, Laka and Trent get some chemistry together as well, which is nice. We've got an 82 rated goalkeeper, an 83 rated goalkeeper, which is quite nice. If weekend league is ending after next week, then I'm sure. It, no, I don't, I don't think the weekend league is ending after next week. I don't know where that uh, the Archon token ends next Friday. Season ends, so you get 15 wins next before 6 p.m. next Friday. Yeah, after the weekend league token ends next Friday. That's what he. That's what he was talking about. Yeah, I got you. I got you. Um, all right, let's put Bale over there. Oh Jesus Christ! I don't need tips every time I try and. Uh, Change my underpants here. Come on, EA. Uh, let's pop him over there. Let's get Mbappe up there. Get him in there. He actually gives him some chemistry, doesn't he? Uh, center mid. Oh, we can go. That's too bad. Put Mandy in there. Had some English players. We've got Hayden. That gives a nice chem boost. So converting him to a set right back would be quite nice because they're obviously strong link, which is good. Do I put in Basham there though? Get more chemistry, way more chemistry. Not that chemistry is like the be all and end all, especially against squad battles. We'll definitely have Jean Felix in and around. And then what else have we got? You can help me get tokens. You're on PC. Well, that would be nice. Although I don't, I don't need to. I'm not like looking to super super circumvent absolutely everything, but all right, that's it. That's the first. That's the first one. So we're gonna go and play squad battles. And I tell you what, for, for the fact that we're quite literally 20 minutes into the account, the Olympic Leon players. I, I I don't know if I have any mate. To be honest, why is it not putting the manager in there? Hello, EA. Actions. Why? What is happening? Ad manager. Ad manager. There we go. Right. So, um, do I have any Leon players? We've got Sakai from Marseille. Is he selling? No. Put six French league players in for a towel. I don't know if I have six French League players, to be honest, mate, as well. You're not wrong, though. We've got Kakuta. We don't have six. We've got Mbappe, Kakuta. And that's your lot. So for the time being, that is going to be our squad for the first game here. And... Uh, yeah for the sake of the video guys just to like make it a lot shorter and and whatnot and not have you watch me playing squad battles um i can't remember what i have to do what do i have to do for squad battles what do i have to do for we're going for alessandrini oh do i even have the right things i know we have to score with french player um yeah for the sake of the video guys we're going to cut the game out i'll see you at the end of it and that will be full time in game number one so a perfect record um a perfect record right now and the first one of 10 games working toward uh alessandrini down it is going to be touch and go as to whether i can complete him for tomorrow that is that's not a lie that is the truth uh we're up to 2.7k coins which is quite nice a whole bunch of uh objective 11 objectives done my word all right the basics three done these are like low tier coins though. I can get two more uh two more games in here before the six PM content. Chemistry one done. That's pointless out. I'm not even focusing on that. And single player one done. Gives us a premium premium silver pack. Uh milestones. So yeah, so we can go and get this guy here. Four separate squad battles matches. Um, so if I go and get a, a League One midfielder that I have and use him, that will give us a little something. 
Otherwise, we completed stadium development. Wow. Real nice stuff right there. Um, objectives. Alessandrini, one done. That was assist. Seven goals using players with four-star skill moves. We're one out of three for the volleys. One out of three for the assists. And then one out of ten for the score with French players. And what other objective did we complete there? What else can we complete as well? Ooh, week four bronze two done. Obviously, we're not going to be able to get too far up the season pass. Like, if we can get to the mid-season player, that'd be quite nice. Um, but uh, I also want to have a look at Rafael Leal. For three goals using... Oh, let me, let me put that Rafael Leal in the team as well and score three goals with him. Start him in the team. Assist three goals with three balls. And score three finesse goals. So I could do everything with Rafael Leal here. Which is very cool. Uh, and then we've got a 75 rated player pack. Very nice. And the supernova is what we're going to take on this account here. For that. And pop that into there. And then we've got five packs in the store. Five packs, eh? Not bad, not bad, not bad. Mid yeah, mid-season play is easy to get. But you bear in mind we've got seven days left, right? Three goals with Liao also works towards Silver Beasts. You only need to do one of the Liao. What do you mean? Because I want the I want the pack right at the end. So it's it's not about getting the whatever comes in the footy thing. Is is it actually about the Electrum players pack that I specifically want? Delaka do hybrid nations for a 50k pack. Yeah, we might, but that will still be there tomorrow, right? And the next day and the next day. For now, we need to start working on time-sensitive gameplay content. Ooh, bored out of that. Oh, another inform. Jovatic, very nice. Oh, is he? Monaco, midfield. Yeah, midfielder from French League, right? Very nice. Just complete the week five and six objectives. That'd be enough for the mid-season card, will it? Uh, and then the club anthem pack, which obviously doesn't really matter. Seattle Sounds is in there. Let's go and uh, put that Rafael Liao into the into the starting lineup instead of Mbappe, and then Jovetic as well is going to go in there. So Rafael Liao goes up there. Jovetic is going to go in there. So we need assist with Jovetic. We need to score with Lacazette, and we need assist with Rafael Liao. It's a bad card, isn't it? But never mind. Uh, let's put... Um, who have we got from Syria here? Syria. We should have a, a Syria like, left mid that we could put in. Um, let's put Pasalic in at that, that spot there. Yeah, there we go. It gives Rafael Liao a little bit of a chemistry boost at that point. Obviously, we're only going into squad battles again. Uh, so for the sake of the video, again, I will see you guys at the end of the game. All right, so game two done. Uh, Rafael Liao was put into the team this time around because uh, we needed some uh, goals and assists with him to get the uh, Rafael Liao team's objective underway. Another 2,000 points for squad battles as well. Another game towards qualification in rivals as well. I think. I think if we get ranked through this i think we get uh division five not that i care too much about the divisions right now but seven more objectives done we'll start with the milestone so winning ways hey that's that's good a two rare goal player pack at this stage that's good for us uh, with regards to a towel obviously we're not working on him at all <laughs> oh it's class uh daily objective done very nice um footies tab we've actually got one player from how, how unfortunate man how unfortunate that uh we needed 12 uh, games, and we just don't have time for 12 games. How unfortunate. Um, but Alessandrini now, 2 out of 3, 2 out of 3, 2 out of 10. And then we also did Week 4 Bronze. So for some Man City Esports uh, badge. And what was the other Week 4 Bronze? Play 3. So we'll do that in a second as well. Week 5 Bronze, Assist again. So we're going to complete Bronze any second now. We did 1 out of... Uh, yeah, one for Rafael Liao gives us the kit. So I've got to put the kit on and then get three goals with through balls 
using Serie A players. Um, so I am going to go and put the AC Milan kit on. And we're going to get ourselves into another game as well. And then after the third game, we'll wrap up today's video with opening whatever packs we've got from um, the things that we've done in the early stages. And uh, yeah, I, I mean... I hope you guys are going to enjoy this series. I'm already enjoying it. And, and we're playing squad battles with a dead team. And that's, that, that for me shows how I'm enjoying it. But yeah, let me go and put, uh, put, the, put the Milan kit on and get into a third and final squad battles game for today. And uh, I'll be right back. All right, guys. So to end off episode one, let's see what we have uh, achieved and accomplished. Uh, we've got seven games left to go but until we can get a towel. And he will be the first uh, big name that goes into our um, our squad. Another 2,000 coins, which is quite nice. Uh, our coins coin, coin balance is starting to look quite healthy already, especially with the fact that we've got a, a decent amount of tradables and Lacazette as well. You know, So uh, we could easily get ourselves up to like 40k coins very, very quickly. Um, week 5 bronze is now done, which is nice. It unlocks week 5 silver. Uh... Rafael Liao, we have done this one as well. So that gives us an AC Milan badge that we're going to have to put on for the next game, which will allow us to finish him off and get ourselves that prime Electrum players pack and another 450 uh, XP. Um, we've also done week four bronze, which gives us a bit more XP, uh, which is obviously uh, very nice. And we have now done two of four from Alessandrini. I didn't get the volley in the last game. Uh, it, was a, it was a decent squad battles team, so uh, I couldn't quite... Couldn't quite get there on that, but we're at uh, two out of three for the volley, three out of ten now for the uh, for the games there, and uh, yeah, not uh, not too bad. And silver beasts, yeah, seven out of eight for the assists. Oh, I should have done that already, shouldn't I? Really, we've got to work a bit more on that as well, and do a bit more on that, which would be nice. And then season progress is going to see us get another pack, um, and I think we'll 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 fully fully end today's video off building one one player pack. Uh, one one player pick pack just to see um just to see what we get see where our luck's at so uh, nothing from the 75 plus pack other than it being a rare gold uh sacco very nice we've got a two rare gold players pack this is for the wins objective and i think we'll start like rifling through that quite quickly as well on the, this series um nothing out of that either two low rated rares oh barella's a nice one to have um he can actually go into the team to be fair a premium gold pack coming in and and we've, we're starting to, obviously we need to get icon swaps done pretty quickly i probably will look to go and purchase some players for icon swaps uh, what do we get there four more players wow thousand coins unlock which is very nice uh another um syria player which is quite nice our syria squad is starting to build out a gold players pack we're almost up to ten thousand coins now as well which is very nice come on walk out boards no never mind um we've got some more stuff again for icon swaps some of this stuff will be quite handy uh, even for the squad battles icon stuff and then a jumbo gold 26 pack to uh to be the final pack here from the store no walkout no boards no blues no cheese oh didn't we use him in an sbc well miles ailing who's actually going to quite be quite helpful for us and a few uh, another thousand coins and a few other bits and bobs. So the coin unlocks are obviously quite handy. That does put us into five figures for the coin balance. Um, but yeah, let's uh, to end off today, guys. We're going to take some untradables. Uh, we're going to do one player pick. We obviously need seven rares. I don't know if we have seven rares that I want to get rid of. Ruben Vezo, I don't. Anthony and Sarah don't mind. Oh, yeah. Ruben Vezo, we will. Mandy as well is a tough one to get rid of, isn't he? Alair can go. Yep, and then some commons. All right. Let's see. Let's see if it pays off. Or maybe it doesn't. Only one way to find out. Only one way to find out. Let's pop him over there. Pop him over there. Pop him in there. Boom. All right. Only one way to find out is one player pick pack. It's nothing major, but maybe it is. This could be the start of something great. It's not. Um, who do I actually think would be the best here? Probably Fernando for the rating. Everyone else will come as they come. 
So that is going to be the end of the video for today. If you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like, rate, and comment. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And for now, guys, I'm out. Peace.